distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I uh, would like to extend my sincere gratitude to the International Labour Organization and um, Food Agriculture Organization of the United Nations for organizing such an important event. Mongolia's new social insurance system has been established in 1995 and it is legally possible for rural um, target groups, herders and the self-employed to be covered on a voluntary basis. In accordance with respected legal regulations, social insurance offices are committed in all um, administrative units of Mongolia to fulfill those achievements. In other words, social insurance services and staff in 330 local small administrations in 21 IMAX, the provinces, provide social uh, security service as one-stop shop, which allows uh, herders and farmers and the self-employed to receive services quickly and at low cost. Taking into account that the income of um, uh, rural population is actually instable, uh, the uh, uh, Voluntarily, social insurance contract specifically states that the contribution can be paid on a monthly, quarterly, semi-annual, or even annual basis. Uh, for example, as herders earn uh, income by selling cashmere and animal products in spring, uh, they sell um, summer, in summer more milk, the meat is uh, sold more in autumn or winter, uh, so the flexible payment schedule is closely linked to their income cycle. Uh, in order to maintain the social protection of citizens during the COVID-19 in uh, 2020, total amount of 23.5 billion uh, Mongolian two Greeks were paid um, as social insurance premium for almost 170,000 voluntarily uh, insured people. This uh, measure is uh, supposed to vital actions in order to prevent from the reduction of uh, pensions and benefits uh, for herders and self-employed in the future. In light with the common use of uh, mobile phones and uh, the internet for Mongolian citizens, both in urban and rural areas, herders and the self-employed have been able to, uh, enter, into, uh, uh, to enter into the um, um, uh, voluntary insurance, uh, also to renew them uh, using mobile phones and uh, pay their premiums uh, for social insurance um, by uh, banking accounts, by banking uh, applications, internet banking, mobile banking, QPay. Uh, QPay is actually uh, greatly allowed to receive uh, services regardless of uh, um, time and, and space. Uh, information on premiums paid by herders and self-employed people insured with uh, social insurance can be obtained online through a number of electronic channels, such as official website of the organization, um, multiple organizations, uh, social insurance agency, also the ministry, um, the applications, e-government services, um, uh, uh, small machines. Uh, so the uh, Mongolia is really uh, very much um, developing its portal and applications. Uh, one of the 10 most commonly used uh, e-services during the quarantine periods was actually social security uh, contributions um, uh, uh, contributions. Um, so in uh, 2021, uh, the ministry have, uh, has uh, just introduced an electronic social insurance uh, booklet and the pension books and um, provided the, uh, all the retirees with bank accounts and, and uh, cards. Um, this saves a lot of time and money for the insured and the pensioner and uh, allows all social security services be transparent. Uh, with, the, with, the, with this, I um, mentioned some good practices and achievements on social insurance issues, but we are still on demand on learning from others and bet, uh, for better social protection. So we are really right now working on new social uh, security um, laws and legislations. Um, I thank you for your attention.